friends today we are solving the given question the given equation for the number of roots and the types of roots so let's begin with the question when there are three numbers we have to convert it to four numbers first so if there is no number with x square we have to write x two time let me select a color and with pencil so we are selecting x two time right x and x we have to put the numbers here what kind of numbers we will put now we will have to find it out so let's begin with the numbers which numbers we are going to put now have a look here this is one number with x square 1 times 48 is negative 48 so my main requirements are negative 48 when I multiply two numbers I should be getting negative 48 when I add or subtract the same two numbers I should be getting plus 2 negative 48 and plus 2 are my two main targets and it is achieved by the two factors which are number 1 is it's 8 the second is 6 if I put negative sign with 6 that will be far better because I will be getting plus 2 so 6 time negative 8 is 48 and 8 negative 6 is 2 so these are my factors I have to put it positive 8 and negative 6 we find out the factors now what we, we are going to do now we have to make both the factors both the terms equal to 0 x plus 8 equal to 0 and x negative 6 equal to 0 now we'll shift 8 to the other side we'll say shift 6 to the other side so x positive 8 will go to the other side will come negative 8 and x equal positive 6 so these are my two solutions and both are real numbers okay so that's the end of the question the question has two real roots one is negative 8 negative 8 and 6 and so let's begin with the equation we have to factorize the equation if we can so we can clearly see we can factorize this equation y to the power 2 and raised to the power 2 will make 4 minus 256 is a square of 16 so just write 16 equal 0 you remember the rule a square negative b square equal a plus b and a minus b we have to split it similar way a plus b y square minus y to the power 2 minus 16 a minus b and a plus b y square plus 16 equal zero now we have to make each equation equal to zero so y square minus 16 equal zero and y square plus 16 equal zero plus 16 i'll write it a little bit more clear now we can transfer the 16 to the other side y equal negative 16 y square and y equal positive 16 it's y square sorry pardon now if i can factorize a number further i will factorize it as i can see i can factorize it taking a square root of this because i need y equal plus minus 4 will come but here when I take the square root of on both sides so it will come y square equal to negative 1 under the root equal to i so it will come positive negative 16 is the square root of 4 
it will come with i, which is imaginary part. So this equation has four roots. Equation has four roots. Four roots. Two real numbers. Uh, four negative four are real solutions and plus 4i and negative 4i are imaginary. Thanks for watching. If you like the video, please click thumbs up and subscribe my channel.